Right, so you might recognize this place. We're in South Wales. Look, the sun is shining. It's not just about rugby, rugby and Welsh cakes. It's about koi. So we're going to head over there and have a look at some of these gigantic koi. I had to go to the gym all week to get myself ready for this event. And uh, today we are at Ian and Carmen's. So join us as we have a look at some of their fantastic koi. There you go, we're measuring up. We say in measuring, but this is like guide measuring because <laughs> the equipment is not up to the job. I think we might have to put it in a It did, yeah, yeah. And uh, tell everybody what size you got it at. Oh, um, I can't remember the measurement, but it was a, just a, it was a neat size. Yeah, so roughly, yeah. I guess it's between 55 and the yeah, most. Yeah, yeah, not not a big fish at all. You know, when it was when it was purchased, right. it's been with us for quite a few years now. And, um, so what's the age of it now? Oh, I I think it's about um, I'd say it's about seven or eight, that's probably. Much away, and uh, yeah. So we're gonna once it calms down a bit, we're gonna measure it. So it was the one that um, Mike Mike imported uh, the. That particular year, you know, it was like a like a little growing on team to encourage the Grosanti to, to feed and stuff. And he always kind of did so that. So Nisai wasn't super expensive. No, not really. But it was the end of the season, and you know, it was the time when he, he decides that you know they've done their job and right. they know they, they 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 they're made available for sale. You know. Yeah. So. Uh, and now it's one of your pets, really, isn't it? Yeah, really, it is, it's it's indeed, lovely. yeah. You know, um, Carmen picked it out. You know, they, they, they looked at all the old gongs that were left over and they picked it out for the best sort of structural body type. Um, and it was a discussion was made and that's the one that uh, they picked. And, and, and it's always grown because, you know, they, they, they picked the right fish for, the, for, for growth, you know. So we said 92 centimetre last year. So we got the uh, other Ogon out, which is the bigger body. Just an amazing koi, guys. You've, you've not seen a body like this for a while. If you've been at any koi shows, um, uh, like Ian said last year, there, there was a massive difference in the size size of these fish. Um, sorry, I'm just adjusting the uh, sizes of these fish, but this year they seem to both grown a bit, certainly bodied up a bit. So we're just going to get a bit of footage of this koi and. Um, yeah, see how we get on from here.
You put in a sedate there like we pour wine. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go. Uh, if you if you ever want to understand Kiwa and a Koi, you got to head over to the National, or if you're not a National, look at this. Look at the Kiwa and this thing. It's crisp, it's clean, Marizomi Kiwa, which is the sought after type of Kiwa. Um, for those of you watching it, that's Marizomi Kiwa, right where Ian's hand is there. Absolutely stunning fish. Perfect, and this fish is not young. I think you were saying what, 10? Is this the one? No. No. Yeah, I think this fish is where we had this, you know, we got this fish many years ago. I think it's about 8, 9, or 10 maybe. Well, the terry on it, I don't know if the camera can pick it up, but you can see the terry on it. And the kiwa is just gorgeous. Yeah. Sashi is where you want it, non existent at the age. Head is beautiful. I think this might be coming to Leicester if you don't want to take it to show. <laughs> this, this fish. Uh... A little bit um, we were talking you have to be a little bit uh, harsh this year because you need to thin out some of your stock yeah and you've got some fish that you're not selling it because they're terrible fish it's just because you got like me you got fish in japan you got fish yeah. you want to raise and yeah you got to make some choices aren't you yeah we had, we had, we had a couple of years ago we had some toes i um uh Izumiya, ogons and things like that you know and yeah. we, we picked the best ones out and sold a few off but some of those fish are, they come with total, they're, they're 80 now, yeah. you know, so 80 cm now. So you have to, you, you can't keep Try on keep adding 80 yeah. centimeter plus to, mm. to your pond, no matter how, how big it is, mm. you, know, you know what I mean? So uh, reality kicks in at some point and we will be moving quite a few fish on this year, I think. So if people are interested in a fish watching this, obviously the UK, well, the UK only, uh, how do they get hold of you to come and... Yeah, they can they can send me a PM if they want. Right. Um, sometimes I put some of the fish on uh, on Rad's uh, um, koi, for koi, sale. koi for sale. You know, yeah. they they go on there, and then there's various people in the koi clubs that already have bought a fish, yeah. and sometimes they ask you for something else, don't they? So yeah. you know, but but if somebody's watching the video, they can just send us a PM. They can connect with you. And yeah. you're on Instagram, you're on Facebook, but mainly Facebook, right? Yeah, I'm yeah. I'm on I'm on mainly Facebook, I guess. Yeah, yeah. but I am I am on um, Instagram as well. Yeah. 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 So, uh, I'll, put, I'll well. put your contacts in the description so people could contact you.